Hello everyone, and welcome back to Foxtech. Today I'm gonna to talk about and walk you through the process of generating images using ChatGPT on your iPad. This guide will cover everything you need to know. Let's get started. First of all, you need to have a dedicated app for ChatGPT installed on your iPad. You can easily find this app on the App Store. While it's technically possible to use ChatGPT through a browser, using the app provides a much better and smoother experience. Trust me, it's worth the download. Next, it's crucial to make sure you have the paid version of ChatGPT known as ChatGPT+. Unfortunately, without the ChatGPT Plus subscription, you won't be able to generate images directly from the app. However, there is a workaround. If you go to the Doll E website, you can log in and create your own pictures there for free, at least for a limited number of times. But for the best experience, the paid version on the app is, is the way to go. Now, let's get into the specifics of creating an image. The first thing you need to do is describe your image clearly. Think about the objects, people, scenery, colors, and any specific style or mood you want to capture. The more detailed your description, the better the generated image will be. Once you have your description ready, you need to specify the dimensions of your image. The default and recommended size is 1024 x 1024 pixels. This size works well for most needs and ensures a good level of detail in your image. Next, you need to mention the number of images you want. By default, the app will generate one image, but if you need more, be sure to specify that in your prompt. To recap, combine all these details, your clear and detailed description, the image dimensions, and the number of images into a single prompt, then submit it and let the app work its magic. And that's it. You're now ready to generate amazing images using ChatGPT on your iPad. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Foxtech for more tech tutorials and tips. See you guys later.